Barcelona won their first game of the new year despite having an extraordinary 17 players unavailable due to coronavirus or injuries. But they picked up the three points taking themselves up to five on the league table. Today we discuss the tactics, in particular Ricky Pugue's role that won the game for Barca. Barca pressed high as always, trying to put pressure on the opposition. But we did see 4-4-2 formation with Ricky joining Luc de Jong up front. Once the ball went out wide, the two up front pressed the play on one side trying to leave no space between the lines forcing them to go long. In order for the team not to go backwards, Xavi had Ricky cut out passing lanes to prevent them to play backwards, forcing them long. When they wanted to switch, the opposite winger came out to press. For a while now we saw that Xavi likes a compact shape in the middle not leaving space, together with a high line that compressed teams and encouraged them to exploit the high line. But he trusts his men would win those balls or even his goalkeeper. When defending the box, particularly towards the end of the game, Barca defended in a 4-5-1 formation, with Ricky dropping behind Luke de Jong. That is so that the midfield is covered and the wingers can help out the full backs. But what did Barca do in possession? The opposition didn't press particularly high, so Xavi wanted to stretch them horizontally and vertically. So Barcelona could build up easily, but Barca's deep lying player, often Frankie de Jong, got marked extensively. So Xavi had them change their positions constantly. That was done to confuse the opposition and also create gaps for each other. They even dribbled sideways to drag players away. And particularly Frankie de Jong could exploit this with his excellent dribbling skills, where he then could look to link up. Barcelona had numerical advantages everywhere, leaving players to decide where to press, or whether to stay. This made them disorganized often making the wrong decisions. A lot of gaps appeared then and Barca played through them easily at times. Having one striker made it easy for Barca at the back. The free eight stayed in the half space to keep the opposition narrow to create space out wide. The centre-backs were tasked to dribble forward to draw players out of position. That's to create space in these regions. But Ricky's role made the difference in this game. He was tasked to play passes out wide to stretch play more. When play were one side he often found the opposite wingers and full-backs in acres of space. The goal even came because of that. He received in the half space. He then found Oscar over on the other side, who crossed the ball to the far post finding Luke de Jong who heads in for Barca's opener. Barcelona did incredible well under circumstances. With a depleted squad they managed to find a way to win. This win takes them within one point of the top four. Barca fans can be proud. Thank you for watching this video. We would like you to subscribe for more Barcelona content. We tactically analyze all Barca games. Subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out. Goodbye.